Dear church family, thank you so much for taking a few minutes to allow me. Just kidding, it's me, your nephew Chris. Hey, Uncle Tommy, how's it going? Don reached out to me a few days ago and she said, uh, hey, would you mind saying a few words for your Uncle Tommy's birthday, his pastor appreciation? I said, no. She said, please. I said, fine. So here I am. So with that being said, happy 80th birthday, Uncle Tommy. Congratulations. You made it this far. Um, you've made it through so much in your life, several wars, uh, numerous presidents. And I just want you to know that those tennis shoes you wear in the pulpit they're not fooling anybody. And additionally, happy Pastor Appreciation Day for a guy whose culinary expertise don't really go much past pouring himself a bowl of honey smacks and additionally uh, pulling out a gift card at the Longhorns. You do a great job at growing churches and you do a great job at loving people and so myself and along with every other member of the church i know is greatly appreciative of that um, you know i think it's pretty cool that you were able to start in a grocery store in a piggly wiggly and as you said you're able to finish in one now but what's funny is you have not stepped in a grocery store in any other capacity in between those two points in time it's solely been aunt diane so we're thankful for her as well um, but just to summarize it all, happy birthday, happy Pastor Appreciation Day. Well, Tommy, it's uh, your favorite nephew here. Don't worry, it's still our little secret. I'm pretty sure nobody still knows. I uh, just want to take a second and wish you a happy birthday and uh, tell you how much I love you and tell you how much you mean to me. Um, you've been such an inspiration to us all, a great male role model, a great human being. Um, you know, you know, when I was going through my my darkest of darkest days, you were you were there for me. You were my shoulder that I needed to lean on. You were my my, my calm and guiding voice. Um, you were the person that that I counted on. Um, I slept at your house. I ate some of your food, heard some of your stories, drank some of that almond milk that you said was so great. Um, <laughs> but you were there for me, and uh, I'll never forget that. I love you. And I uh, hope to see you soon. Happy birthday to the best twin ever, even though we're not twins. I love you. I'm proud of you. And I hope you have the best day ever. Brother, happy birthday. I thank the Lord for you. You've been a friend for over 38 years. What a blessing to have had you to be my pastor. And I do. I think you're probably the best pastor in the world, brother. I love you. And I pray you have a great day. Hey there, Brother Tommy. This is Steve Steinel, the president of Luther Rice College and Seminary. I just wanted to say happy birthday to you, and thank you for all you do. Thank you for your service to the local church. Thank you for your service to the local community, and thank you for your love for the Lord. Pastor Tommy, my friend, my neighbor, just want to say happy birthday to you. I'm thankful for you. I love you, and I pray for you every week. Have an awesome day. Have an awesome birthday. Love you, buddy. Hey, Brother Tommy. Happy birthday. I just wanted to say uh, I'm so thankful for you and uh, your example of servant leadership. I often see you uh, around with your sleeves rolled up, uh, diving right into serving others, and um, not only your uh, being a good shepherd to your flock and loving and caring for them, but for the community around you. So thank you for that example, and I hope you have a wonderful birthday. Happy birthday, Brother Tommy. I trust that the Lord will bless you richly today. Thank you so much for your faithfulness to our Lord and to me and so many other pastors around the state. We appreciate you and your ministry. God bless you, my friend. Love you. Pastor Tommy, this is Gary Hobbs at George Walton Academy. Just want to wish you a happy birthday and thank you for all you mean to our community and to George Walton Academy and the families that go to church there. We're looking forward to having our baccalaureate service at the 1025 Church on May 15th. Thank you for letting us do that. We're excited about our school year and uh, what all 1025 Church has to offer for our school and our community. We're so happy that we've been part of what you started over there at 1025 Church, all the exciting things that you do there in the church and what you've meant to this community and the involvement here through your work at the high school and your help at the Child's Voice Child Advocacy Center. Tommy, I can't thank you enough. And Pinnacle Bank is proud to be part of 1025 and all the things that you're doing over there. Happy birthday. Happy birthday, Brother Tommy. 
Um, thank you so much for the work you do in our community. Thank you for your leadership and thank you for you and your church and uh, being the hands and feet of Jesus each and every day. Thank you, Brother Tommy, for always being positive, um, always shining your light and being involved in the community and being a great pastor. I can honestly say there's only one thing I don't like about you, and uh, that's the fact you're not a bulldog. Hey, Tommy, I want to say happy birthday, and thank you for all you do for Monroe Area Athletics, especially boys and girls basketball. It takes an army to help our players and our teams reach their goals, and we appreciate all you do for us. Happy Pastor Appreciation Day. Well, Brother Tommy, I want to wish you a happy, felicitous, joyous, blissful, supernal birthday. Thank you for your cherished friendship. You're the best in so many ways, including preaching, pastoring, and growing a church. And best to all you wonderful folks at 1025 Church. Good morning, Preacher Tommy. Coach Whitley here from George Walton Academy. First period Bible class, getting ready to have class. A uh, little bit of lesson today on Proverbs. But before we do that, we want to wish you a happy birthday. Have a good one. Hello, this is State Representative Bruce Williamson wishing you, Pastor Tommy, a happy birthday. You've been a blessing to your church, our community, to my former business partner and, and uh, Billy Musselwhite and his family, and also to me and Vicki. Thank you for all you do, and thank you for the way that you share the love of Christ with everyone you meet. God bless and happy birthday. Tommy, this is Rudy Camp, Comer Baptist. I just want to wish you a happy birthday, and I just want to say thank you for being there for me and Julie, you and Miss Diane, and um, in the hard times, and uh, teaching me how to pray and how to trust God. And I hope you have a great day. We appreciate you. Coach Reach, just want to wish you a happy birthday. Listen, I appreciate everything you do for Monroe Area Football. You and I have got a great partnership here. I love you, my friend, and uh, God bless. Happy birthday, Tommy. I love you. We as a city appreciate you and we wish you many more years of success. Happy birthday, Brother Tommy. Thank you for being such a wonderful example of the way that we should love God and love people. You have been a wonderful leader and inspiration in our school and to my family personally. We love you. Happy birthday. Hey, Pastor Tommy. I pray it's a wonderful day. I know it's going to be a special day at 1025 Church. We are so thankful to have you here in this Walton County community, and it is a privilege to call you a friend. Good morning, church. It's me, Tommy Fount Sr. Now, I know y'all don't recognize me as I travel back to 1985 to record this message. And as you can see, I still had my Alabama mullet back then. All joking aside, uh, Pastor Tommy, we love you. I uh, can't say what a blessing you are, not only to my family, but all the families you've reached in the community that uh, we are so privileged to call home. Uh, I look forward to continue serving alongside of you for years to come. And uh, the words of Joe Dirt, keep on keeping on, brother. Brother Tommy, I'd like to take this time to thank you for all that you do. With that being said, I'd like to thank you for what you do for this community, as well as the Monroe Police Department. I'd also like to thank you for being there for me and my family and always be willing to talk whenever I need somebody to talk to. From the bottom of my heart, I can't thank you enough for all that you do. We appreciate you and we love you. Well, good morning, Brother Tommy. Today is such a special day as we celebrate and honor who you are and just what you mean to each and every one of us. I personally want to take this time and say thank you for all the many nights that you have answered my late phone calls and the times that you've responded when I needed you the most, you and I both have stood on some very traumatic scenes together. I've witnessed you love and minister to some hurting families, but I've also witnessed you love and minister to my officers as they too face some very challenging times. So for that, I'm eternally grateful, and I just hope and pray today that you will feel the same love and support that you have shown so many others. We love you, we appreciate you, and God bless. Good morning, 1025 Church. I'm David Hardwick. Tommy is my all one. So they went to my food. Stop! What are you doing? We're supposed to be talking about how Uncle Tommy influenced us. I'm trying to be like Uncle Tommy. <laughs> 
dude, you're killing me. We're supposed to be serious about his ninth anniversary and about all the things he's done there and about his birthday. At his age, man, you got to celebrate him while you can. That's right. H happy birthday, Uncle Tom, man. Congratulations on nine years there at 1025. We're so happy for you. We love you. Listen, I want to say how much uh, I appreciate you and how you've uh, prayed for me, you've mentored me, you've taught me so much. Some things not what to do, but a lot of things of what to do, right? That's right. That's absolutely right. But I I've watched as, Tommy, you've taken what was Grace Baptist Church, just a handful of people, and with God's blessings, man, have just grown it tremendously and shown me in my heart, I have a heart for church revitalization, you've shown me what it's all about, and it's not some special formula. It's about loving God and loving people. So thank you for that. Happy birthday, happy anniversary, and we love you. Good morning, 1025. Uncle Tommy, happy birthday, and congratulations on nine years of faithful ministry uh, there at 1025 Church. Everywhere I go, I get asked if I'm related to Uncle Tommy. And uh, my kids actually ask, is Uncle Tommy famous? I usually tell them yes, but I don't know if you're really famous or not, but here's what I do know. You have been an incredible uncle to me. Uh, you have taught me so much and poured into my life, and I am so very grateful for you. You've also been an incredible example of what a minister and a pastor is supposed to look like. Uh, my life is better because of you. My ministry is better because of you. And Uncle Tommy, I am so very grateful uh, for you. I hope you have a great day, great birthday. I look forward to talking to you soon. And again, happy anniversary, happy nine-year anniversary there at 1025. <laughs> Remember, we're live at 1025.